my other son is snorkeling and the dogs are in the water and we're my son is in the shade and then these police come because and they come dra just back off and they come directly up to my son sitting in the shade on a rock watching his dog in the water okay. and this lady over here says to me maybe you're a tourist and you need to be quarantined and then this officer arrests my son because it's against the law, he says, to sit on the beach in the shade and watch your dog run in the water. That's what's going on, America. Are you happy? Are you happy? When is everybody going to stand up? And yeah, I'm fucking pissed. And yeah, I'm yelling at them. And yeah, I'm telling this is unconstitutional because this is wrong. This is wrong. On my window. I don't knock on your window. Why are you here next to my car right now? I didn't knock on your window because you just slammed the door and I've been hearing everything. I can do what I want in my apartment. You don't. You can't eavesdrop and listen on I, me. I don't care what you're doing. No one eavesdrops on you. You're nobody to me, sweetheart. You're no one to me. All right. You're no concern to me. Right. I don't care what you have to say. I don't care what you think. I don't care what you do. What I want you to do is leave me the fuck alone. Because if you don't, me and you are going to have a big problem. Okay? I and you're going to have a bigger one. You're going to have a fucking bigger one. So what I need you to do is get the fuck out of my face. Get away from my property, which is this vehicle here that I pay for. I'm over here. Step the fuck back. Get the fuck away from me. Go wipe them ugly ass fucking raccoon eyes out of your face. Because they're disgusting. But Just like your face. You, your face. I care of my business. I take care of my customers. I have brother business for peace. He doesn't accept responsibility. This is not how you do business. Sir, sir, sir. I'm going to ask you to leave. No, you're not going to ask me to leave. I'll call the cops. Please, call the cops. Please, call the cops. I'll call the cops myself right now. Take my money back. Guys, you're standing by. I'm trying to explain to you. Then give us the $23 and we'll be out of your way. We can show you we paid for it. And we'll never come back here and we'll leave negative comments on everyone's on iPhone. Let's call the cops. Please, please 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 call the cops. I'm saying I gave you an order. I don't care about the, I'm, I'm worried about your order. I'm trying to get your okay, order. Okay, it was $24 for nothing. Have some no, it's not about nothing, man. We didn't get the order. We proved. Guys, let me explain something to you. We don't work with Slice. It's not our company. It's a third party. We work with Slice. No, 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 stop. I put it right up. And this is what makes it up. Okay, you can ask me. And that goes to Slice. Why is it a third party order? You know what? He needs to shut up. Man. Get out of here. Let's call the police. Yeah, you know what? We're really here with you. Anger is called for in this situation. No, it's not. Let me tell you something. We're trying to make your food. Oh, thank you so much. But I spent $24 for it. Man, I understand. Is it really worth filming? Oh, let's take a picture. You know what? This will. Yep. I'm here with you, right here. Oh, I on. see okay. you, right there. Okay. I see you, right there. Okay. I see your, I see your bitch, right there, recording me. I see you, nigga. I oh, see you. You look ridiculous. Come on, let's go. You're 50 oh, years old. She's not 50, dude. I'm, I'm not 50. 50. Okay. But, you but you guys understand, yeah, like, we're not trying I'm to do anything to bother you guys. Listen, no. You guys. Listen, no. You're the same I'm, age as my like, kids. Like, we are. Like, we are. Like, so why are you arguing with people that are the same age as your listen, kids? Listen, listen, listen. I'm a professor at Sac State, dude. I have a PhD. I don't need to be dealing with shit like this. I have my master's. Fuck you off. I don't give a fuck. I don't need it either. All right, then. Look, I, you don't have to control me. I'm control. I've had enough of your shit and your shit. And you, I'm tired of you hey, people breaking the rules. Please say no cussing. Please stop cussing me. You can't cuss in the pool area. It There's been no cussing in the pool this entire time. And also They're says you have to have there. proper swimmer on. Also pool. says you can't be We're here past 10 o'clock. Get out. It says you, have to, you can't be here past 10 o'clock, and I see you and your family up here all the time. Past I manage this pool, and I keep things clean here, and I Please. fix things, and get out! You can't follow your own rules? Get out! I'll wait for the police to escort me out. If, I'm sorry. Because I'd like to talk to them as well, for the way that you're treating me. You're being a belligerent little child, and I have asked you to leave. You're being a harassing old man. You are harassing me for swimming at the pool. You're violating the rules. So are you. You can't cuss. You have to be wearing proper swimwear. You can't be here past 10 o'clock. Turn that phone off. No. Why? Because you want to disrespect me? You want people You're to know? You're disrespecting me by arguing with me about the rules. You're screaming in we my face. We have rules to follow Sir, around here. you are screaming in my face. Get out. Ma'am. 
Ma'am, open the window. Ma'am. This is the Sonic workers. You see how they treat us? <laughs> Fucking Sonic work. They messed up our order. Witness Excuse it. me for swearing. I At a 15 my... year old. That is not okay. It's not okay? No. But it's not okay. It's not okay to, to swear. It's boss. okay to yell at him for you running in front of your car. Yeah. But it's not okay to swear at a little kid. A little? He's 15, right? 15 is still little. Okay. I'm 15. Year they old. just entered high school. Okay. And you're swearing at him. You, you know what? You're making no sense at all. No, you're okay. making no sense at all. Listen you really to just me. need to leave. Listen. You really to just me. need to leave. Listen to me. I have no interest in listening to you. Well, you, then you, have, you can't debate a thing. Then you just okay? need to leave. I have, we have plenty I literally of kids just gave you the whole pets. thing. Plenty I don't care about pets. your kids and pets. You were but in the car. You had to spare. I don't I care. I slowed down. You cross the street and then Was you cross right. Was there a pet in the street? There was no pet in the street. I don't know no, why you're bringing you kids and pets into the conversation. A barbecue oh, here at the lake. What's going on? Oh, now she don't want to talk. <laughs> she doesn't want to talk now. <laughs> Uh, it's illegal to have a charcoal grill in the park here. No, it's not actually. I just yeah, looked at the it map. Is. It says this is a designated barbecue area. No, it, if you, it, not for a charcoal grill. No charcoal grills are allowed. Do you want to see it? Yeah, you gotta try and give it cheap, it, yeah. You must not have looked up. What kind of later. grill are you not allowed? And why are you so bent out of shape over them being because here? Because it, it causes extra money from our city to uh -huh. do things when children get injured because of an improperly disposed home. So are you saying that they're going to hurt children out here or I mean like what what is the, with this There's laws yeah, about this rack. park and I know the laws about them. this park. And charcoal grills are not allowed here. <laughs> so they should go Go somewhere else. Who do I complain about to her? Give me the number. What's your store number? From the top of the list. Yes, that's over there. You want a manager to talk to me? You bring your manager here. If you want to talk to me, you bring your manager here, you idiot. Or go speak Chinese with your other staff. Talk to me somewhere else. Get him somewhere else. What the hell is going on? If we start fights with all your people, then get him in the back. That is rude. Shut up and get out of here, you idiot. Stop. I never stop. Yeah, you do. What, I do not. You think we bang on the ceiling for fun? You bang on my ceiling all the time. I am so tired of it. You think we do it, it for fun? You think we do it because we're bored? I am tired of you. Well, I'm tired of you, lady. I'm tired of having to listen to your crap every oh, night. I don't do it every night. Every night. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, really? You need to get her, sir. You, you can get, get my ass. I am tired of you. Oh, thank you. I am not going hey, anywhere. Let me tell you something. My kids are asleep. Get your ass back upstairs, lady. I am so tired of you. Get upstairs. Go home. Honey. Go home. Hey, you need to get her. I'm going to call the cops. You need to get her. Come on, honey. Call him for what? Because, because you're I, because you're on my I'm doorstep screaming my at me. You're on my doorstep screaming at me and my Why father. Why did you come up asleep. to my house? I do. We you don't answer, answer the door. Do go Why? go home. Why go should home. I answer the door? Go home. So lady. you can call the cops. Listen, my kids are in. Stop. Hey. Okay. They can't feed their it family. Doesn't, it doesn't matter. He's out it here. It does matter. He's out here trying to make a living. I don't want him in my neighborhood. You go to Indian Wells, you don't see lawlessness. It doesn't matter. They call the cops. It brings down quality of life. You're not a police officer. You're not a police officer. Excuse me, I'm a you citizen. Let, you I have the a right to officers, speak. You I have the a right to speak. Deal with that. So let the, the cops are coming. Yeah. Go so ahead. The cops, the cops are coming. You need let to stop them harassing come this man. No. That's harassing. You need to stop harassing it's him. Not harassing. Karen. Him. Karen. This is our property. Stop harassing oh, him. Oh, you live in Indio, Karen. You don't know any of these books? What kind of uh, what kind of cockadoodie bookstore is this? That you don't even know Paul Sheldon? Paul Sheldon, who, let me tell you something. I am Paul Sheldon's number one fan. His number one fan. And you can't be telling me 
that you don't have Paul Sheldon's books here. Isn't there anybody here who knows about Paul Sheldon? Isn't anybody familiar with the misery books? I'm telling you, how could any of you be in a bookstore when you don't know Paul Sheldon? When you've never read misery? I can't, what is wrong with you all? I don't understand what is happening. No worries, man. No worries. I am looking for a cock-a-doodling book. I can order it for you.